Welcome to the premises of the European Directorate for the Quality of Medicines and Healthcare. This Directorate of the Council of Europe, that traces its history back to 1964, is also called EDQM. The building was inaugurated in 2007. Designed by Brussels-based art and build architects and by Denu et Paradon Architect in Strasbourg, and built to high environmental quality standards, the design and the materials used in its construction reflect the diversity of the activities taking place inside. Have a look at the rounded facade made of steel and glass that houses the laboratories and the reference standards preparation area. Note the clay brick walls surrounding the meeting rooms on the ground floor. See the distinctive green copper for the administrative area, the offices on the upper floors. In this building, pharmacists, chemists, biologists, laboratory technicians, together with translators, IT specialists, statisticians, contribute to the EDQM's primary mission, the protection of public health through the development, implementation and, in a monitoring role, application of quality standards for medicines. Imagine in these premises experts from all over the world working with staff at the EDQM to elaborate the European Pharmacopoeia. But what actually is the European Pharmacopoeia? It's the official reference used by professionals involved in the manufacture and quality control of medicines. It's applicable in 39 European member states, including all the members of the European Union. The pharmacopoeia is a compendium of standards known as monographs used to control the quality of pharmaceutical ingredients and finished products at manufacturing sites across Europe and beyond. Let's take a well-known medicine such as ibuprofen tablets as an example. Whether you buy it in a pharmacy in France, in Austria or in Iceland or whatever the brand, you will obtain the same quality. This harmonization was made possible by the Convention on the Elaboration of a European Pharmacopoeia in 1964. It's binding on all signatory parties, obliging them to apply the European Pharmacopoeia quality standards at national level and also to contribute to their elaboration. The EDQM distributes a catalogue of more than 3,000 reference standards worldwide to manufacturers of medicinal products and their ingredients and to the organisations involved in their quality control. These reference standards are crucial since they are used to perform the tests and assays described in the quality standards published in the European Pharmacopoeia. In addition, the EDQM runs a quality evaluation programme for ingredients for pharmaceutical use that includes inspections of manufacturing sites. It also plays a coordinating role in quality control programmes for both medicines and cosmetics. Other areas in which the EDQM is active include the development of quality and safety standards for blood transfusion, for organ, tissue and cell transplantation and for pharmaceutical care. The activities of the EDQM contribute to ensuring that you have access to good quality medicines and healthcare in Europe and beyond. <laughs>